Good evening, folks. Right, well, I've got home from work a bit early today, which is good. And I'm working from home tomorrow, so that's good. Good. We've got a live schedule for Stupid Clock early tomorrow morning where we'll do the, um, well, we'll get through the laying down eating fest. But um, she didn't give up YouTube. Oh, surprise. Um, she's done a live today. And she's done this this video of her pigging out at the Indian restaurant. So let's let's just do the restaurant one because it's only 15 minutes. Got some dinner cooking. So, yeah, that's in the oven for the next sort of X amount of minutes. So we'll get through this one and uh, I'll upload it. So here we go. I thought we rebranded. Hello, foodie beauties. <laughs> Of course, we've got to see the drive and we've got to have some some authentic music. Is it? Don't know. Anyway. Yalla! What? Wow, look how red and well scuffy her face is. Oh, the teeth look grim. Lady, you need to get to the dentist. You've got no enamel on your teeth. I think that's what's missing. Or just a good brushing. Wow, look how fat and swollen her fingers are. Wow, that ring actually didn't look like it was garroting her finger when she first got there. <gasps> She's blown up like no one's business. Oh, that looks painful. Oh, look, the mosque they never go to. Hello, guys. How are we doing? Hi, guys. We hope you're well. We're here at an Indian restaurant that's well known in Kuwait. Salah recommended it. So let's go in and try the food. Yella. Let's go. Is this the new mics again? Because they're rubbish, or is it just like there? It's really, really windy there. Oh, look, he's chosen another restaurant where he can shut her away. Oh, please make there be... No, there is seats. I've made a thumbnail. There is seats. I was just having a little moment there. Please, not again. So this restaurant is not only an Indian restaurant, it's more of an Indian fusion kind of restaurant with a mixture of... Oh no, has she done the, the, the chatting over the top of this again? Oh. oh well, let's see. So we're in the Indian restaurant. Okay, got you. Again. How's that diet going to go? Aren't we going to the gym in just how many days now till Ramadan starts? Is it the 21st? Tuesday? Is it the 21st or 21st? you got to be down the gym next week. Uh-oh. Arabic food, Indian food, Asian food as well. They're really known for their sizzlers, and we will be trying one today. Hi. What? So just to show you a bit of the menu, you can see they have everything it's very eclectic from pasta to lobster to chinese food to tandoori specials tandoori chicken chicken tikka okay. all of the indian favorites and paneer now we're entering paneer territory i'm getting excited uh where's the uh where's the paneer ah there it is i've been what is this this horrible voice thing that she's doing um, I know she's had a bit of a sore throat, but is that not cleared up yet? Ugh, got no throat. I'm craving this and missing it. I love it. Palak paneer. 
What's she been there? Two weeks. She's been there two weeks. Is it two weeks? Yeah. Well, just over two weeks. I've been craving it. I'm missing it. You haven't stopped eating. When have you had a chance to crave anything? Mm. No, paneer butter masala for sure. Let's get it. Yellow. Stop it. So with this tool, you call the waiter. <gasps> so cool, huh? Mm -hmm. It's the doorbell thing, isn't it? So cool. Everything is cool. It's a button on the wall. Have a bottle of water? A tissue for... In fact, it might even be a light that is on there. It's just probably a light switch, isn't it? Where you just click it on and they can see that the light's on outside your, your tomb booth. The napkins, like I said. I mean, I have eaten in places like this. Not very, not many times. I have eaten in places like this in the Middle East. Um, not everywhere is like this. I am personally a little claustrophobic. I mean, she must be feeling a bit claustrophobic in there. Wait till the summer kicks in. It gets really humid. Air conditioning or not, you can't get rid of that humidity. This one? What is this? It's some Papa kind of... Dom. God, it's a Papa Dom! Maybe they can comment <laughs> in the... Com Papa Dom! <laughs> Papa Dom with mint sauce! Well, minty yoghurt sauce. That's what it is! She's such a foodie. Comments, if they know what this is, it's like a hard bread with this sauce. It looks like mint, mint sauce. Mint yoghurt! I think uh, bread with garlic. Let me try. That's not garlic bread. So Salah said it's spicy. What? Hey. Gonna dip it? I don't think that. I don't think that's spicy. They're usually quite salty. Mm. It's a proper dom. <laughs> that's actually really good. We had a that is a mint night. kind of sauce. Yeah, it's mint yogurt. With a spicy savory kind of cracker like dehydrated bread it's... and they give you some lemon wedges yeah, well usually there's a little bit of salad have you not got some salad there as well oh well never mind no mango chutney it's probably the british version different i never tried that if you guys know any of the names of these things or have tried these foods comment below okay we get it Pop Dom, going in the mint yogurt dip. Gotcha. Oh my god. Mm. She's the biggest troll these yes. days. <laughs> Giant plate, that'll please her. We go mill for six coming up. <laughs> wow, <laughs> they must have run out of fat coke. She's all the diet coke. What's wrong with her? They must have run out, or maybe she orders diet drinks when she's in public. It's like some butter melting on top of it. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Yes, you may. Oh wow. <laughs> the big show. We did it. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> what the hell is this? Oh my goodness. I mean, are we at a Mexican restaurant now? What? What is this? I mean, it's huge, so she's going to love it. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh my gosh. The smell. Mm, mm. It's called the sizzler? Yeah, exactly. It consists of uh, chicken, meat and shrimpy. With friend chicken, meat and shrimpies. Fries. For this uh, nice... And chips. Yeah, that's not very Indian, is it? So it's chicken. It's going to be lamb. It won't be beef. It's chicken, lamb and shrimp. Shrimpies. Sauce with the mozzarella cheese. Oh wow! This is like an Indian 
mixed that. fusion poutine. And there's broccoli also. What? Oh, yum. An Indian mix and broccoli as well. This is a strange mix. Probably nice. Not knocking it. I'd give it a go. Check this out. Yeah, it's on a hot. It's on a oh, hot plate. Nice. Vegetables. Yeah. Yeah, leave them. Blech. Hey, foodie. They're not fried enough. Blech. And some bread, non bread. Okay. And the butter. Paneer masala. Oh, look, she's spilling oh, it everywhere. Yeah. The butter melting on top. The fresh coriander. All right, guys. Bismillah. Hey, guys. Oh, hang on. He's just shoved a great big plate of food right in front of us. They're not using the side plates. What's. No, is that just our dinner? So I'm going to eat a bit with you guys, try this food. Now, the lighting in here is not the best, but. Fine. That's okay. Diet Pepsi? Yeah, yeah. Skinny Queen. Don't forget the chips. Go ahead. With lemon. Such a culinary experience. Mm. Try it out. She's huge. Salah's trying the paneer. What do you think? Not bad? To be honest, it's so delicious. Really? Yeah. He loves the butter paneer. Let me try the paneer here. Oh, that's it. Well, he, he likes it. Oh no, I've got to get in there in case he eats it all. <gasps> Stop it, Salah. You weren't supposed to like it. Really? You like it? Oh man. The naan bread is so flaky and freshly made and light. <laughs> it's not so light and flaky now. You've just like folded it in four. Beauty bite. Here we go. Honestly, lady, it's plenty oh, wow. of bread. Mm -hmm. That's delicious. You want to try a piece of the paneer in the bread? Oh, sorry. <laughs> the butter leaks on the... No problem. I'm going to try... Well, it's no problem for you. I mean, she look at the mess she left at the last place she went. The paneer on its own here. Go on then, trough Keep down. Nom, 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 nom. Mmm. Oh, fantastic. You like it? Yeah. She really is like the hungry caterpillar who's not going to turn into a beautiful butterfly. She's just going to stay in that hungry caterpillar come Pac-Man kind of state forever. Tasty. All right, honey, let's try the sizzler. It's a hot, so we have what? to be careful. Why are they... Why are they not using the plates? These are sharing dishes, aren't they? They've got no rice with that, mind you. Bloody hell, they had enough rice for, like, I don't know, half a country just a couple of days ago. Um, but they're not using... The... Mm. Just not using the plates. I don't know what the sauce is. Do you know? The sauce... Tastes like cut some kind of gravy of mixed meat. Like, I really can't tell what the sauce is but you can bet your life it doesn't wow, taste different. like gravy we have some i think meat here <laughs> wow <laughs> could you stuff any more in there in one go nom, 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 nom. Mm. she's burnt her mouth <laughs> so hot i know Ooh, <laughs> the temperature this you so greedy, you couldn't shovel it in there quick enough, you burnt your mouth. This is what wow. they're known for here, it's the sizzler meal. So what do you think of it? It's actually really good. It's Hang very on. different. I've never she's had anything like this. Look at that, she's making a point to eat a bit of vegetable. Broccoli is my favourite. Broccoli and spinach is my absolute favourite. Broccoli? Mm-hmm. Broccoli is one of my favourite vegetables. Is it? Stop lying. Especially with cheese. Oh, God. Some meat steak. Lemon with Pepsi just hits. 
because nowhere else in the whole big wide world puts 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 lemon in cola. Nope, nope, they don't. This paneer though, I've been missing it, so I'm glad I get to finally have some here. Look at this bread. It's so light and fluffy, or like it's like flaky. I can't describe it. It's so good. How's the shrimp? Yeah, tasty. Nice one. I'll wait for it to cool off. Especially with the sauce. This gets more flavor, yeah. Some meat. Oh, wow. Look, she's, <coughs> excuse me, she's airing on the side of caution because she burnt her mouth the last time she digged in there. For some reason, I was expecting the excuse meat me. to be Coughing. a little chewy. It's actually really soft. It's lamb meat. I don't like lamb, but I like it this way. I think I finally found a way I like lamb in like a bunch oh, of gravy lamb. on a putin. <laughs> I call this a mixed fusion putin. What? Mm. A mixed fusion putin. Putin is like cheese, gravy, and chips. We've seen it. The sauce is very savory, salty, very delicious. I'm going to try a shrimp as well. Mm. Oh, that's so good. It looks like um, a mixture of oh. mixed vegetables like you would have at a Chinese restaurant. <laughs> Yum. This is a strange combination, isn't it? It might be nice. I mean, not lamb is nice. I can taste the fresh cilantro. Of course you can. That's so good. The gravy of the butter paneer masala is rich and creamy. Yeah, I give them a close up of that. <laughs> well, it doesn't look the best, but it probably tastes really nice. <laughs> bon appetit. Kind of like a um, like tagine kind of slow cooked lamb by the look of it. Nice. Hey, babe. Same to you, baby. Thanks for suggesting this restaurant. Any time. <laughs> Anytime, every time. This is really good with basmati rice as well. Mm. Yum. <laughs> Beauty bite for you guys. I love this gravy. I, I, can you not say sauce? The sauce that is cooked in. It's not gravy, is it? Oh. It's reminiscent of a beef gravy made with... Even though it's lamb. Got ya. Like real meat. Uh, drippings and... What? Like some kind of Indian spices. It's, it sounds like a kind of Moroccan tagine type of... Um, okay. Yeah. In gravy. Mm-hmm. It really beef, is just a... Beef gravy with lamb, shrimp, and chicken. Yeah, it's not that, is it? Fusion. It's like a huge mix. She, she really... She she hasn't really then tried that much Persian food. Um, This looks really... I don't know about all the mix of it, but it's probably really nice. Mm. Wasted on her. She Near thinks it's beef gravy. You get a bit of the smokiness from the sizzler plate. So you get a bit of, it adds a bit of smokiness flavor to the food throughout. Stop it. Really interesting, different flavors. <laughs> Such a foodie. Oh, cabbage. Yes, too hot, be careful. It's like a thousand degrees. <laughs> By the way, it's still, it's like heater. Yeah. <laughs> well, Two yeah. hours later. Mm. The chicken with the gravy sauce. It's not damn so gravy. So if you like this, you more than likely will love poutine. Mm. <laughs> really? Yeah. Really? I'm trying all of these foods that. That what? That Salah recommends, but I really want him to try poutine someday. <laughs> yeah, when he can, when you take him to Canada. Oh, 
Yeah, there's that. Uh oh, he's never going, is he? I'm sure that one, <laughs> Yeah. Oh, what? Yeah, he's like, mm, God willing, one day I'll get to Canada and get to get that poutine, and then I can leave you. This nightmare will be over. I'll definitely make him some. I can't wait. <laughs> How are you going to do that then? Where are you going to get your chips? Isn't Putin like gravy and cheese curds and chips? Okay, I don't, I don't think she's going to make that for him. Where are you going to get gravy from? I love trying new different foods. So interesting. Well, you, but you're eating paneer. You live off of that in Canada. I mean, of all the different Indian Indian dishes that there were there, you didn't want to try anything new. You wanted your old faithful. Loves trying new food. What a Burger King, TGI's, McDonald's. Mm. Bon appetit. Mm. <laughs> Wow, he literally has put that giant plate of food right in front of her. She's doing this for the feeder content, isn't she? She's got to be. Has he taken them side dishes off? Because they were big plates and just like put them next to him on the, on the seat. Mm. See, now, do, do you think those plates were there? So that you could actually take some food, put it on the plate, and it wouldn't be red hot. It'd have a chance of cooling down. I don't know. Or like you, you've got the potential gono throat or something going on here. You're putting your fork in your mouth. Then you're putting it in the food. Then he's putting his fork in the food. <clears throat> no. The gravy is amazing. Oh, it's not gravy. Shoes. Yeah. Look at the excitement on her. Ooh. I'm always thinking, this is just like Canada, minus paying my taxes. Brilliant. All right, guys. So I just wanted to share this restaurant with you. Again, we're going to enjoy our time together and our food. I wish I could share with you guys. Huh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow, they've eaten a load. She's eaten that. I can't see him having put a massive dent in that. That was a lot of food there. Mm. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> Finished. Alhamdulillah. Slay. <laughs> Slay. <laughs> Honestly, every washroom. See, oh God, when she calls this a B-Day, this is not a B-Day, it's the bomb gun. Get them in all, all around Asia and the Middle East, Turkey, places like that. It's 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 just an arsehose. Should have one of these bidets. <laughs> it's not. They're amazing. Look, bidet is a thing that is like a toilet where the jet of water, where you can temper it to control it so it can get the warm water. These things come off the cold. Cold. Blue and freezing. Blue and freezing. And every bathroom has a bum gun in the Middle East. Uh, uh, the house we I had, the apartment we had, bum gun, uh, plugged into the cold. If you know what I mean, you know. What is she doing? <sighs> yeah, boy. No thanks. Well, that was that. Um, didn't go on too long, did it? Perfect. Right, okay, I'm going to go and check on my dinner. Uh, download this and upload it. And tomorrow morning, I know I've scheduled it in for 6 o'clock, but that's kind of the only time I'm going to get tomorrow. Um, we'll do the laying down, eating the rice. I know it's a bit late. I know she's done a live today. Um, we'll see what she's got to say on a live. Maybe we'll do that as well. Let's see how we go for time. I've got to wriggle my um, computer up again here. 
So if that if I can get that done first thing in the morning and everything works the first time, um, then we might have time to do a bit of that that live that she done today whilst leaving YouTube forever. What a joke. Anyway, have a super evening. Look after yourselves. And um, I doubt I'll catch most of you in the morning, but hey-ho, we'll, we'll give it a go. Anyway, take care. Much love to you and yours. Bye.